Good afternoon, everybody. It's Carol Jones again coming to you live on Thursday, May the 7th. Again, you guys get to listen to me ramble just a little bit so we can see if we get a few people on. Um, but I am in a little subdivision off of Boat Club Road and Huffines Boulevard, kind of in between, called Marine Creek Meadows. And going to show you this cute little charming one-story house here in just a second. But I hope you guys are doing well. Um, beautiful day. It's pretty windy, so I apologize for the wind noise. I'm doing my best to try to shield my microphone. Uh, from that so I won't spend too much time outside so let me see if we can switch the camera around a little bit excited to show you guys this cute house okay so today I am at 5005 Sky Meadow Drive again it's the Marine Creek Meadows edition it is just off of Boat Club Road uh, and in between Huffines Boulevard just kind of sandwiched in there uh, great location I uh, can't miss it but just a cute little traditional neighborhood so side neighbor side neighbor over here as you can see um, this house is uh, 1,959 square feet um, wait till you see this front door it's so so cute front door that pops. She just love that. I love it when people paint their front doors. So cute. But great little entry as you can see. Brick all the way around. A little outdoor light. Great gutters. Part of the roof and we'll show it to you uh, from the back as well. But the roof is new. It's only a year old. So that's a plus. I'm sorry if y'all hear that roaring. That is the neighbor's air conditioning. So as you walk in great open floor plan I'll walk into the entry here shut this door. and so as you can see it's freshly painted great crown molding all throughout the house great attention to detail in here so as you walk in this front room to the right could be used as a little formal sitting area an office um, craft room it could just whatever you want to use it for just a great open space something that I will point out while I'm looking at this window is the windows in this house do have solar screens which is as you guys know in Texas is a plus keeps that uh, hot air out hot Sun uh, from beaming in on your house um, so even the little small window up here at the top has a solar screen so that is a huge expense that's already been done for you. And then to the left is your formal dining area. So if you have a big table, um, six seater table should fit in here with no problem. Again, lots of great natural light. Little nook here to put a pretty vase or flower. Again, you got crown molding throughout. And then this leads to the kitchen. And we'll go through there in just a minute, but let's go down this hallway. You have a tile entry. Um, you have the laminate wood flooring in here. It's all brand new, brand new carpet. And when we come in here, you have the um, entry closet, coat closet, good size. Those are always kind of nice to have. And then you've got a, a cute little plant ledge or a home decor ledge, as you want to call it, up here. You can put all kinds of cute little knickknacks up there. Again, freshly painted, brand new carpet. Lead straight ahead, takes you into the living room, or we can take a right, and this will take us into the extra room. So let's do that. To my left as we go down this hallway is the second bath it's a full bath freshly painted new light fixtures single sink but you got plenty of counter space plenty of storage nice tub and then directly across is our laundry again tile floor plenty of space for wash and dryer 
Then you also have the uh, drip rack up here, and then you have counter uh, or cabinet space, excuse me, up here for some stuff, laundry soap. And then this leads to the garage, good size double garage. Also freshly painted floor, which is nice. <coughs> excuse me. Um, attic space, you have your hot water heater out here. Nice little workbench for anybody out there that has uh, a need for that. And then you also have some shelving up over here. So, like I said, it's a great size garage. Shouldn't have any problem fitting two cars and some bicycles in here. Okay. <coughs> and these are the extra two rooms. Again, new carpet, freshly painted, new light fixtures, window, and then here's your closet. Great size double door closet. And it's even freshly painted in there. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. I got a tickle in my throat. Third bedroom. Again, light fixture. The double closet. <clears throat> and now let's go... living room so as you can see open concept <clears throat> new counters backsplash it's kind of that um, gray <clears throat> contemporary look this is one of those induction cooktops so it's cool to the touch if it's on so if you have little ones not have to worry about them getting burned, which is a plus. Good size little island. We got lots of counter space. Cool farm sink. Subway tile backsplash. Again, all of this has been freshly remodeled. Great little sitting bench for the kitchen nook, which is also very nice. And then good size pantry here. And then again, this leads back out to the normal dining, as you can see. Refrigerator, great Whirlpool appliances, dishwasher, even have a trash compactor. But it all opens up to the living, as you can see, and it's very popular right now is to have this open concept. Love the fireplace mantle. Again, crown molding is throughout the house, as you can see. Another little plant ledge. For those of you who like to decorate little nooks, that's great. And fireplace, open living room. Again, lots of windows, natural light. You guys know how I love natural light. And then those are the French doors that lead outside, and we'll go out there in just a little bit. And we have another closet, kind of a linen closet, storage closet, whatever you want to use it for, games, maybe. And then this is your master, good size master. Great windows in here. It's kind of the oval backside to the backyard, vaulted ceiling. Again, more crown molding. Double doors to the master. Very bright in here. And as you walk in, immediately to the right is your closet. Good size closet. It's got the triple racks. Goes all the way in. And then you've got um, some shelving here for some shoes or t-shirts. And little rack on the back to hang like belts and ties on. And then, here's your tub.
Again, you got the solar screens on these windows, so that's why it looks kind of dark. Um, but it's a great plus to have those, especially in Texas in the summertime. You will appreciate that. Let's walk back out to the living area. Again, it's great size. I don't know if I mentioned, it's 1,959 square foot. It's a three bedroom, two bath house, all one story, which is great. Great little neighborhood. And let's walk outside. So this one also has the extended porch on it for seating. We have some great landscaping, the red rock. Um, trees have all been trimmed. Bushes have been cut down, so good. All brick. Let's walk around out here just a second. Very private backyard. Brick all the way around. And then again, guys, like I said, the roof is only a year old. So that's another plus for you. Great fencing, though. No, really need any, any fence work at all. It does have a sprinkler system. It's just got a lot of features you wouldn't expect to find. Um, got little hooks already for your hanging baskets. I just did that this weekend. Went and bought some flowers and a little late. Again, solar screens on these doors, so that's what makes it look dark. Uh, but again, a very, very much needed feature. So this is a HOA community. Um, the pool is on Marine Way here in the subdivision. Turn the camera back around a little bit. Hey guys. So it's $400 a year for the HOA and community pool uh, to keep up the entrances into the subdivision. Um, the schools are uh, Eagle Mountain Saginaw, if that's uh, a plus for you. Um, this one is going to be the um, Chisholm Trail High School path and ready for you to move in. I can help make it yours. Uh, again, it's been completely remodeled. All of the extra money, uh, the roof, flooring, carpet, sprinkler system, all of that's already here for you. It's just waiting for you to come in and see it. So I would love to help you make this yours. Like I said, I have a great team of lenders and title companies. Our brokerage is great. Um, give me a call at 817-343-8074 and you can always reach me on my website at caroljones.realtor. <clears throat> Sorry, I still got a frog in my throat. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this tour. Sorry for the coughing and, and all the wind noise outside, and hopefully you were able to hear me. But give me a call if you're interested in this house. It's just waiting uh, to make